All right, let me make myself clear about something. One, I consider myself a liberal independent. There's a few issues that I'm to the right on. Most issues I'm on the left. I know that there's a lot of problems with the left right now. I'll leave a link to an article that goes more into what's going on with the left. There are fewer and fewer moderate people on the left. Whereas the right wing, they've moved a little bit to the right in general. Not as much as the left has moved far to the left. But there's very few things that the left and the right agree on anymore. It's become so incredibly polarized. And, and again, I'll, I'll leave a link to an article that shows some of this. My fear is that as a country we're going to move to the right a great deal. Okay, I don't want to see this happen. That's why I'm concerned about how so many people, you'll say that you're on the left, but you never criticize the right. That's a concern. That's a huge concern, because what that means for the general public is more shift to the right. You go, well, it shouldn't be that way. Well, that's the way it is. That's how that works. And... When people are saying things like, oh, well, well, mainstream media criticizes the right uh, enough. Well, considering that most people who are criticizing the left are claiming that everything that's criticizing the right is fake news, and as legacy media is, well, legacy, it's not being as important in people's lives anymore, as people move to the internet to get their information and to get their news, and people are continually being told that uh, mainstream media is fake news, what is going to happen? We're going to move to the right. And yet some of you don't want to do anything about that. You're just like, oh, we don't care about the threat from the right. Uh, the, may the biggest threat is from the left. Well, we do need to be concerned about the left. I, I regularly make videos... Uh, criticizing the left, but I also make videos criticizing the right. We need to be concerned about what's going on on the right wing. So when there are some really popular people in, in social media, like YouTube, when there's really popular people who claim that they're on the left, but they, they, they don't criticize the right, they're not critical of the right. Like someone like Sargon, right? I mean, he continually criticizes in the U.S., stuff that the left is up to. But when he doesn't criticize the dominionist and reconstructionist right, when he doesn't criticize the way that religion plays out in the United States, it's easy to assume that he is tilting to the right. Whether or not he actually does tilt to the right doesn't make any difference, okay? When you're on a platform such as this, what you say is what makes the most difference. I mean, what difference does it make what you really are when the message you put out is, is something else? It, it upsets me that so many people on this platform are unwilling to be critical of the right. The only right wing you're able, willing to be critical of is the alt-right, the actual alt-right, the ones that are blatantly racist. They're the only ones you, you uh, say anything about. And some of you because those on the right are criticizing the left, you'll, you'll pretty much pair up and join up with those on the right. Well, we have a common enemy. It's the left. It just, it's, it's messed up. So, again, I consider myself a liberal independent. I put those labels on myself, and to me, the message that I put out matches what I am. Now, maybe it doesn't. Maybe to some people it doesn't. I try to criticize both sides. I wish more people would.